Add a new guitar tuning to Tux Guitar. I want to add open D tuning to Tux Guitar. I go to Track, Properties and then click on the wrench next to Tuning. Plus. Adds another note to EADGBE. I want to add an entire tuning, DADGAD. How do I do this? Enter image description here. Understanding standard tuning. Standard tuning is E5, B4, G4, D4, A3, E3. First you have to understand how note or pitch I should say notation work. The letter indicate the note name, the number indicates the number of the octave. Hence, A4 is an octave higher than A3. As a reference, remember the standard tuning absolute notes, or at least that the lower string in standard tuning is E3. A weird naming quirk to remember is that it doesn't change of octave number when passing from G to A, but when passing from B to C so B4 is only a half step away from C5. Understanding how your tuning differs from standard tuning. Open D tuning is D5, A4, G4, D4, A3, D3. Notice how the 3rd, 4th and 5th string are the same. You won't need to change these. So, in your situation, when tuning it to open D, you have to tell Tux Guitar that you want a different value for the 1st, 2nd and 6th string. Retuning a string in Tux Guitar. For this example, we will retune the 6th string from E3 to D3, but you can actually retune to whatever note you want, even notes that wouldn't be logical on a real guitar. In the tuning menu, enter image description here. Double click. On the last string E, E3. This prompt should appear. Enter image description here. Then for the value drop down select D3, which is the note you set your sixth string when you tune it to a open D tuning. Alternatively, you can press up two times instead of looking for your note in the long list. Pressing up to go a half step lower is pretty weird, but hey, that's how Tux Guitar was made. Let the second drop down label update automatically to D. No need to touch that one. Press OK. Your prompt should look like this. Enter image description here. Retuning to open D, dadgat. Repeat the first operation for the first and second string. The values should be respectively D5 and A4. Last prompt should look like this. Enter image description here. Press OK. Press close on the track properties window. Test if that worked well. Here you go.